Before we begin today, you need to have your bean bag and a scoop. Remember, if you don't have a bean bag, you can ball at the side. We're going to begin with warming up. Put your scoop down for now and just practice tossing and catching between one hand and the other. Your toss should go very gently and up right in front of you. You really want to pretend that you're in a box and your bean bag stays in the box. Moving my hand to where I think the bean bag's going to land, and that's how I catch it. Keep your palms up. All right, now try just with one hand, straight up and down. Oops, too far. Try the other hand. Your bean bag is staying in front of you, and you don't have to run to get it, then you're ready to add the scoop. If your bean bag is flying all over the place, then maybe you should stay and practice this for a few more minutes. Remember, nice and gentle with your toss. Now I'm going to add the scoop. Doesn't matter which hand you hold the scoop with because we're going to practice with both. Toss the bean bag up and catch with the scoop. Toss the bean bag up, catch with the scoop. What I'm doing is I'm predicting where the bean bag's coming down and I move my scoop to that spot. Toss, catch. Toss, catch. Toss, catch. If you're getting frustrated, you can put the scoop down and you can just practice with your hand. I think I'm going to switch hands now. Oh, if you missed, that's okay. If you feel like challenging yourself, you can do it one-handed. Remember, if you can toss straight up, you have a better chance of catching it. I'm going to pause the video now and let you practice. 